Okay, for starters, I like the flower from my daughter, Sophie. Say hey. I shot this whole video yesterday and it turned out great except for one part. During the whole video, I was referencing the two best words or most important words when it was actually three. So I'm reshooting part of the video today to kind of make up for my errors yesterday. All right, I'm gonna share with you all the three most important words to accomplish any goal that you have, whether it's fitness, whether it's health related, business related, these three words will change everything and they are let's do it. Because the three words let's do it is an invitation to someone else to come join you and do it with you. Like with anything, if there's two or more trying to do something together, it makes it easier because now it's not just you trying to get um, whatever goal it is accomplished. You now have people that are doing it with you. And with that, you have accountability because with doing any of these things, whether it's eating healthy, trying to you know lose weight, gain muscle, whatever, you have days where it just it, you drop out. You don't have the desire. You don't have the will to really go forth and keep doing it. But if you have a partner, someone that you you know enlisted to work with you to accomplish that goal with you, you have someone to keep you motivated on the days that you're not doing as well, or you're not really you know motivated to keep pushing. This comes from a Bible verse that says, "If two or three agree, nothing is impossible." Sorry, my son is climbing all the way up there right now. Now, this is something that I'm, you know, speaking to myself on this because on some areas I've done well with this. Like um, when it comes to bicycling, I have um, a good friend of mine that goes with me named Ken, who definitely, definitely helps push me because it kicks my butt every time we go biking together. And so that whole let's do it works great that feel because I have someone to push me harder than I would push myself if I was by myself and now when it comes to you know eating good I have my wife that um, that I eat good with so you know she's you know kind of my accountability partner I'm making sure that you know I'm eating well or if I go to cheat and have a snack I shouldn't have and now the area I need to work on when it comes to uh, weightlifting like now the first year that I did my whole, you know, losing weight and getting in shape, I didn't do any weightlifting as far as like going to a gym. Everything I did was calisthenics and plyometrics and just eating very good, eating like you're supposed to eat. And but now to get to the next phase where I'm trying to gain 11 pounds of muscle, I've got to start lifting weights and doing it on a regular base. And whenever you do anything like that, it's hard to go to that point of failure with every set. One, because it definitely helps have a spotter, and two, because sometimes your morale is just down and you need that person that says, hey, you've got one more set, keep going. So the two most important words that you will ever encounter when it comes to accomplishing any goal that you have in life are, let's do it. Hmm. Well, I just kind of stumbled over the fact that I had a brain fart. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. And it's not just two words, it's three words. So let's ignore the fact that I said two words about this whole video and it's the most important three words. Let's do it. Well, please let me know your thoughts down below. I try to get to every single message that are that is left. So if you have any questions, please leave them below. I'll get to them. And thank you for watching. Keep going. So Sophie, do you like to exercise? No, I don't. Why not? Because it's boring. Boring?